After weeks and weeks of grinding, today I'm finally gonna get the Terminator. Welcome back everybody to the fourth episode in my series to get the Terminator. This will probably be the last episode there is. Make sure to join the Discord, link is gonna be in the description. There's always tons of active giveaways if you just wanna talk to me, get carries. Alright then, enjoy the video. And there we go. Finally, Enderman Slayer 7. I can now collect this reward and we have the recipe the terminator so now that we've unlocked the recipe for the terminator let's actually craft it we're gonna need a lot of stuff for this but the main ingredient that we're gonna need is the investment core here so as you can see it's 279 million coins it's the main ingredient this is, looks like it's lowest spin so let's just go ahead and buy it now as you can see here we're gonna need a few more materials though Okay, so the audio bugged out when I was crafting it, but we finally have the Terminator now. Alright, now let's max this bad boy out. For the ultimate enchantment, we're going to be going with Soul Eater. Uh, I could get Duplex, uh, but I don't really want to spend like 180 mil on that, and Soul Eater is nice for the first term. And here we go, let me just take it out of the hex. So here we go, our Terminator is finally maxed out. I put Fumings, obviously I had to. Art of War looks a bit cheap right now, so I just decided to go for it. Uh, it's only like 6.6 .6 mil, so worth it. Uh, Soul Eater 5, as I said before. I put Power 6, obviously, Overload 5. No Dragon Hunter right now, maybe a bit later. Uh, 5 Star, obviously, Dungeon Item and all that stuff. And this Terminator can now replace my Juju in the first slot of my hotbar. So, there we go. Before we go any further, as you can see, I only have 51 crit chance, because Terminator divides your crit chance by 4. So, we have to fix this first. The first thing we can do is change our Power Stone to Fortuitous. Uh, this gives us 97 more crit chance. I'm also going to put my tunings on crit chance. So, I'll clear, go on crit chance. We get 0.2 per, which is not... Oh, not that much, but we get 12.4, which is nice. And now, holding it, we have 70... 877 so let's see what else we can do all right so next what i'll do for crit chance is spend a bunch more money on enrichments this time yeah this is not good okay so there isn't much else we can do about the crit chance scenario but this thing really shines in dungeon, that's where I'm going to be using it the most. So maybe with some dungeon pots and stuff, we can figure this out. Are you kidding me? 97 crit chance in dungeons? Okay, looks like we're going to need dungeon pots. Alright, let's do a quick out of dungeons damage test with the Terminator. It's not really going to do well because this shines mostly in dungeons. But I'm using my Necron's armor with a uh, Tarantula helmet. So here we're doing 116k, 118k, 117k. Yeah, as I said, it's out of dungeon, so it's not going to do well here. Alright, so now we're going to test out the clearing capabilities of the Terminator. There should be a mini boss here. Yep. And he just got absolutely obliterated. I'll just do a quick blood rush with this. Yeah, everything just gets obliterated in the path of this thing. Yep. Archaeologist stands. Absolutely no chance. Bunch of mobs clumped up here. All dead. Wow, this thing is straight up OP because of the three arrows that it shoots. It's so satisfying to hear the dings, man. Alright, so now we're just going to be trying this out on Blood Room, on Yellow Room, sorry. So, let's just pull this up and let's see how it goes. Sticking Midas. Which is annoying. But I can just do the. Why is my entire party here? Anyway, wow. Alright, let's test out Yellow Room. Wow. That was fast. Really fast. Alright, let's test this out on some blood mobs so I got a full blood here. And wow. That sound is so satisfying. And I just instantly obliterated them all. This thing is so OP. Alright, boss room time. Let's see how this goes. And the Wither Miners just get obliterated, but that was like the same thing with Juju, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, now both the crystals are down, so let's see how it goes with Maktor. Wow, I just- that was like sub one second, basically. And second round of Maxor. any second out. Yeah, basically just one tapped him for the second one. 
Yeah, Max or weak, man. All right, Storm. Obviously, these Wither Miners just get obliterated, but that was like the same thing with Juju. Server's lagging, but Storm and okay, my, some of my arrows got blocked there. Let's try that again. The second crush. Someone else is padding. Yeah, it just gets obliterated instantly. All right, gold ore time. Yeah. Pretty sure Goldor has like 750 mil health or something like that. Maybe that's M7, not sure. But he just got like sub 5 basically. Now it's time for Necron. Yeah, look at that DPS. Yeah, that was just insane. This thing just does so much damage. Next thing I want to test my Terminator out on is some dragons, but I'm gonna make the best financial decision I possibly could and buy Dragon Under 5 for this. And there we go. Our Terminator now has Dragon Under 5. Alright, here we go. The dragon's spawning now. Going crazy, man. And we got first damager with 3.2 mil. That was really good. Anyway, that's just about gonna wrap it up for this video. If you guys did enjoy, please make sure to like and subscribe. It helps me out an absolute ton. It motivates me to make more videos. And yeah, uh, join the Discord. There's always a giveaways active there. Whether you just want to talk to me, enter giveaways, get carries, it's all there. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.